Hello friends, let's see next question of Leibniz theorem. So in the next question, it is given that y is equal to 7 raised to x into x raised to 7 and we have to find y5, that is fifth derivative of y. So in the first steps, we will choose v. So v always choose who should choose, which the derivative of some iterations will be 0. So here you can see x raised to 7 will be 8th derivative of 0, because here is the highest power 7. Hai. So I will choose v and 7 raised to x will choose u. Choose now friends, you have to write the formula of y5 according to Leibniz theorem. So y5 is equal to phi c0 u phi limit theorem ka formula in ke term mein hota hai to inko yahan pe main phi se replace kar raha hu theek hai then aapko yahan pe milega v not then phi c1 u4 v1 then phi c2 u3 v2 then phi c3 u2 v3 then phi c4 u1 v4 and finally last term hoga phi c5 u u not v5 u so, in this formula, mein, friends, you have to uh, terms chahiye, wo calculate karne honge, and then substitute your answer. Aa so, here, first of all, I will tell you that if y is equal to k raised to x, hai, then its nth derivative hota hai k raised to x into log k raised to n. We already have proved the nth derivative of standard functions. So, in this video, you will see that k raised to x nth derivative is equal So, if you have k ki jagah 7 put karu, so you can see that u is 7 raised to x. So, I will get the nth derivative milega, which is 7 raised to x into log 7 raised to n. So, friends, now I will uh, substitute this value in the given equation. Mein, hai? So, see, phi c0 is 1, u phi is 1. You can simply put 5 put ki jiye. So, 7 raised to x into log 7 raised to phi u. So, 7 raised to x into log 7 raised to phi u. v0 is 1, which is x raised to 7. Then, phi c1 is 1, phi u. Then u4, u4 कैसे निकालेंगे? ये un की formula में n की जगह 4 put कीजिए, so you will get 7 raised to x log 7 raised to 4. Then v1, v1 कैसे निकालेंगे? x raised to 7 का एक बार derivative लेंगे, so which is 7 into x raised to 6 plus phi c2 क्या होगा? phi into 4 upon 2. Then u3 कैसे निकालेंगे? un की formula में n को 3 से replace कर दीजिए, so you will get 7 raised to x into log 7 raised to 3. Now friends, v2 how will we get out of v2? Look, v ka one time derivative is 7 into x raised to 6. So, what will we get out of v2? 7 into 6 into x raised to 5u. So, I have calculated these three terms. Now, the rest of the next three terms. So, phi c3 what will happen? Phi c3 and phi c2 are equal, but here I will show phi c3. So, phi c2 will be phi into 4 into 3 divided by 2, sorry, 3 factorial which is 3 into 2 into 1, that is 6. So, अब u2 कैसे निकालेंगे? un की formula में इनको 2 से replace कीजिए, so you will get 7 raised to x into log 7 raised to 2. Then friends, v3 के लिए आप यहाँ पर देखिए ये v2 का answer था, तो इसी का एक बार और derivative लीजिए, so you will get 7 into 6 into 5 into x raised to 4. Simply हम लोग end में करेंगे, ठीक है? Then next term, आप देखेंगे 5c4 चाहिए, so 5c4 is equal to 5c1. So, if you know that ncr is equal to ncn minus r, this relation is equal to phi c4 is equal to phi c1, which is equal to phi. So, phi c4 is equal to only phi u. Okay? Then, u1 is find to find the un ki formula, mein n is equal to 1 put. Ki so, you will get 7 raised to x log 7. Then, v4 is equal to 3 times derivative. Lene pe ye mila. So, ek bar aur derivative. Le. So, you will get 7 into 6 into phi into 4 into x cube. अब बचा है आखिरी टर्म phi c phi जो होता है 1 और u not क्या क्या मतलब होता है u ओके सो u not की जगह u लिखेंगे व्हिच इज 7 to x देखिए u not का मतलब होता है u का 0 की टाइम डेरिवेटिव यानी आपको u को एज इट इज लिखना है अब v5 क्या होगा ये है v4 तो इसका एक बार और डेरिवेटिव लीजिए सो so, 7 into 6 into 5 into 4 into x cube का डेरिवेटिव 3x स्क्वायर सो ये फ्रेंड्स है फाइनल आंसर फॉर v5 मुझे लगता है आप इसको आप सिंपलीफाई कर सकते हैं कैसे करना है आपको सिंपलीफाई 7 raised to x हर एक टर्म से यहां पे देखिए कॉमन है यहां पर भी 7 raised to x है यहां पर भी 7 raised to x है और यहां पर भी यहां पर भी 7 raised to x है अब आप आपको यहां पर सिंपली देखिए यहां पर ये 6 ये 6 से कैंसिल हो जाएगा देन यहां पर ये 2 यहां पे कैंसिल हो के 3 ठीक है एंड देन आपको फाइनली uh, मल्टीप्लाई करके आंसर लिख देना है ठीक है वैल्यूज को सो लेट्स सी नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन ऑफ लिबनेट्स थ्योरम